Hey guys, this is Erica. I'm back with Purpose Driven Consulting. And today I just wanted to discuss a little bit about how I got started. So in 2014 is when Erica's Closet started, which was the original name of my boutique, which is now Curvy Chic Boutique. However, at that time I did quit my job. Um, it was like one of those days where you're like, nope, this is not for me. <laughs> I cannot see myself retiring from this job. I'm hating to get up every day. I'm hating coming in to work. Uh, this is taking all my time and this is not what I was meant to do. Now, don't get me wrong. I was in a job that was sort of close to what I, um, went to college for and it was also a service job which I love I love helping people I love being in service but it was not where I saw myself finishing my career my professional career at so I decided um, to do some research I you know did all the research that I felt I could do on starting a job um, I'm sorry starting a business um, particularly I decided to do a women's boutique because a lot of my friends and, um, co-workers, you know, family members said being a plus size woman, it was hard to find nice, comfortable, cute clothes. So that was, and I've always liked to dress, uh, my mom used to sew and, um, she had sold a lot of clothes for me when I was a little girl. So I've always liked to dress. We've always bought a lot of clothes. So um, that was one of the reasons why I decided to start a boutique. But I started the boutique at that particular time because I really did not see myself going any longer on my job. Um, of course, looking back, there was things that I could have done differently things that I wasn't ready for, things I had no idea about, things that were going to happen that you could not have predicted happening. But <laughs> um, I decided to just go for it. And um, since then, I, have, I, I, did, I did have a storefront when I started. And I stayed in my storefront um, about nine months. And then my life took a lot of different turns. I had to do a lot of different things. Long story short, I had to go back to work. So <laughs> I ended up at the um, job that I'm in now. And I've been there five years. But I do my boutique now completely online. And it is, I won't say a part-time hustle. Because my boutique it gets a lot of my time. Way more than part-time. And this business consulting business that I'm starting, I'm hoping to also do um, more than just part-time. So I'm hoping to become a full-time entrepreneur next year. That is my goal. That is what I'm praying for. That is what I'm manifesting. And that is where I'm trying to get back to being a full-time entrepreneur. So that is a little bit about how I got started. And if you are needing some help getting started, you might not want to just jump out there like I did and then have to revert back. So let me help you get started the right way. Let me help you get some um, good business knowledge about what you're trying to do. Um, let me help you decide, you know, what your purpose is and where you want to take it. And you can do all of those things by booking a purpose call with me. And that is on the website, purposedriven.agency, www.purposedriven.agency. Or you can visit me on Facebook and Instagram. Or if you already know that this is exactly what you want to do, uh, go ahead and get on the website and book a purpose call with me and we can discuss what your next steps will be. So I appreciate you all tuning in and listening to a little bit about my background story. Again, my name is Erica Gray and I hope to be hearing from you soon. See you guys.